Hey everybody, welcome to another Good E-Reader app loading tutorial. Today we're going to show you how to sideload WeChat, which is a very popular chatting program onto the BlackBerry Z10. The first thing that we're going to show you do is the actual program itself, because it's not as cut and dry as just using, say, uh, the Android app. Uh, first of all, as you can see, we have it here, and we're going to open it up. One of the drawbacks of WeChat side loaded on the Z10 is the inability to add contacts within the Z10. You have to actually have contacts or chat initializations sent to you from phones running the app. So we have an Android app here. Peter here is going to show you what you actually have to do. So what we have to do first is go into contacts on the bottom bar. You can see that this is me on this phone, Goody Reader, but I'm trying to add my other self, Peter, on this phone. So I'm going to go click Add Contacts. Now, you can do this a number of ways. Add by ID, that's pretty simple. You type in the ID of the person you're going to add, like John Smith, you know, Mary, whatever, and so forth. You can scan QR code, the mobile contacts that's on your phone, or official accounts like Facebook and so forth. So what we're going to do is go to My Profile, because we're going to show you one of the more complicated ways, my QR code. So you can set up the scan QR code on the Android phone and display the QR code on the BlackBerry. Hover the camera above it. And there I am. And I'm going to send a greeting. I'm just going to type, hey. And then we'll see here. Peter wants to add you and it says hey so then you click on the little add prompt accept and then you'll get a notification on your other phone so we'll go back to our chats back a couple menus and there I am right there I've accepted your friend request and so there's you, the high. Yeah, so that you, we can see that WeChat is working. There is a little bit of a workaround on how you add contacts, but we've had a lot of emails and a lot of messages sent to us asking us to show this, so we're showing it now. Now, in order to install WeChat on the Z10, it's not offered in BlackBerry World, which is BlackBerry's official app store. It's only available through our website, apps.goodyreader.com. Now, in order to load it into the BlackBerry Z10, you have to use a computer program, which we'll show you in the next step on how to load it in. But first of all, we actually have to set the Z10 in what's known as developer mode. So what we have to do is access the settings, and then underneath security and privacy, then you see here development mode. Now you can see by default, these are the defaults. We haven't really done anything here. We have to turn it on and we have to enter a password. So I'm just going to use like. Uh, just password 12. You can use whatever you want. Uh, it doesn't really matter. It's not really limited either to a particular number keys. So you can use like a, a three or four digit password if you wanted to. So now that we have the password established, which is password 12, the next part of the video will show you actually what you have to do on your computer in order to load WeChat on the Z10. Okay, so we're back and what we've done is plugged in our Z10 into our... PC via the micro USB to USB cable, and we've gone to our website here at apps.goodyreader.com. The next thing that we want to do is load WeChat into our PC. So we, we merely just want to download it. Now, we do have it in our new apps category here. You can see it's been downloaded over 220,000 times. Uh, we will move this eventually to our internet and connectivity page. But if you wanted to simply find it, if you couldn't find it on the front page, you just type in WeChat in search apps. Now you see we have two versions, once for the Android and once for BB10. Of course you want the BB10 app, so we would just click here. And you can see it 
similar apps. Uh, we want to download it, of course, to our PC. So we're just going to click the download button. And you can do this in any web browser. You can see WeChat.bar. Of course, BlackBerry files are bar files. You do not want to download APK files because your Z10 will not be able to read it. Now that this is downloading, one of the things that we want to do is download something called DDPB. Now this is the program that you use to facilitate apps from your PC to your playbook. So we're just going to click on Essential Apps on the toolbar up here. And the first app here is Load Android Apps on Playbook and BB10. So this is what we want. You only have to download this program once. Once it's downloaded, you won't have to do it again. You can see it's been downloaded a fair amount of times and really recently updated as well. So you can click Download. And this is a Windows installation file. This will pretty well install a small program on your computer. This is the program right here. This is by default what you would see. You can see an IP address, a password, and you see it's connected. When you hit scan and your Z10 is plugged into your PC, you should see these same numbers pop up. Your password, remember, is your development password. This is the password that I told you to note down when you hit settings, security, development mode. Once you have the password and IP number there, you just want to hit connect, and you should see OS BlackBerry 10. Pin number and version number may change because this is mine and I belong to a particular carrier. When you have all this set up, you just want to click Add. You want to click on WeChat and then install. So once this is installed, you should see exactly how we showed you WeChat performing at the very beginning of our video. So you just log into your account. You can start chatting uh, with friends and everything like that. If you have any questions, please comment on this video or you can watch all of our other videos at youtube.com slash goodyreader. And for all of the latest apps, you can see we have them here at apps.goodyreader.com. This is pretty well the definitive source for bar files. We have over 1,200 right now. You can find something for everybody, and we do upload apps every single day. So my name is Michael, and you've just watched a tutorial on how to load WeChat on your BlackBerry Z10.